You've never heard of the Millennium Falcon? It's the ship that made the Kessel run in less than 12 parsecs. We would be honored if you would join us. Hey, Star Wars fans and action movie collectors, got another Acolyte Black Series figure for you today. It is number three, Padawan Jackie Long. This is uh, one I've been really looking forward to. I've been looking forward to getting these all these Jedi from the Acolyte. I thought they were, you know, it was really cool to see how the Jedi were. You know, even, what was it, it ended up being like 70 or 80 years before Phantom Menace, 100 years before the fall of the Empire. But yeah, Jackie played by Daphne Keane. She did a great job. The green lightsaber there. Again, with the sort of new style packaging, got the image on the side, no sort of weird slant on the box, so you can line these up nice. A nice image of Jackie on the back. Being half feeling, half human. I thought she was a cool character. So I'm excited to, to bust open the figure and have a look. So let's do that. All right, folks, here is young Padawan Jackie Lon out of the packaging. Excited for this one. I mean, uh, yeah, I've been looking forward to this one a little bit. Um, just cool to see a, you know, a Jedi that is not entirely human. <laughs> I'd, like to, I'd love to see more, more figures come out of different aliens, which, you know, we've had, you know, Ayla Secura, we've had Kiati Mundi, we've had Plo Kern, we've had Kit Fisto, um, Ahsoka, obviously. But yeah, this is this is cool. This is this is this is a nice looking figure. Accessory wise, she does come with her lightsaber, green blade, interesting looking hilt with the emitter there. It's sort of a blue, blue sort of tip on it at the emitter there. It's sort of a brown leather wrap i'm looking forward to you know hopefully seeing some like art of books or a visual dictionary or something get a look at some of these characters like bits and pieces up close like some good detailed looks at their lightsaber hilts and all that kind of thing um yeah she has a peg on the side there if anything the others are anything to go by that should sit in there okay and you know what it kind of does Maybe there's a little bit of extra plastic or it hasn't gone in as far as it should. Yeah, it's it's in there. Okay, it is holding. But yeah, not super well. You know, you bump that and it's gone. Anyway. Let's take a look at Jackie. Obviously, she comes with her Jedi robe too. Again, I've spoken about this with the last few reviews. They've got the, uh, the back of the hood is sort of stitched down. So you can't get that hood up and over the head. Um... But again, I think that's probably not a bad design choice, you know, to get the uh, the Jedi sort of sitting there with the hood down. I, I'm not I'm not objecting objecting to that anyway. You know, if you really want to, you can snip that and put the hood up. But I'm not too fast. And yeah, obviously it's you know very made very similarly to the others, just a bit smaller. Cause she is a smaller figure, so we're going to take that off. And much like Soul. Um, yeah, I'm digging the... I love the yellow look. I love that sort of yellow. The yellow with the outfit. I think it looks good. I'm liking the different sort of colours in the belt too. You know, that you can sort of just see the uh, the Jedi symbol there, the High Republic Jedi symbol on the belt there. I like the different shades of brown and then there's this real sort of Dark green under sash under the belt there. It's got her pouches. Bits and pieces there. Looks good you get down. Sort of basic simple boots. Obviously the Jedi outfits. You know, they don't differ too much, but they've definitely offered something different with these with these characters. You know, there's a little bit of individuality to them, which is great. Jackie is half Thelen, half human. 
So if you remember Ristal from Jabba's Palace, one of the one of Jabba's dancers, she is a Thelan. So Jackie is half Thelan, which is obviously where she gets the horns and the sort of the facial markings. Let's get a close up look. He's got sort of a sort of very sort of plain sort of stoic look. I probably wouldn't have objected to you know maybe a like a slight smile you know something a little less just sort of flat serious look but i think it works well played by daphne keen who has just been revealed that she's going to reprise her role as uh laura x23 in deadpool and wolverine so yeah good to see her getting out there and doing stuff again and the hair sort of sits over the horns there, looks good. It's got a Padawan braid. A little bit of a little bit of a mullet. Obviously that has to go with the horns. But yeah, the paint detail on the sort of facial markings there, really good. Nice clean application. She also has those on the hands, which is cool. Both hands. Looks very nice. Articulation wise, Jackie has a ball joint in the top of the head, ball joint in the neck. She has ball hinges in the shoulders. Yeah, got the butterfly joints in there. The ball hinges in the elbows. Ball hinges in the wrists. On the left, there is an in and out hinge. On the right, there is an up and down hinge. Obviously, a swivel in there as well. Um, Here's a ball and socket in the thighs, ball hinge in the knees, ball hinges in the ankles, and rocker in the in the feet. And she also has a swivel at the top of the boot. Which I don't think any of the others had. I, I'm lying, I just discovered Indara had that. Let's see, I've got Sol here too. No, his are all, because I think we discovered that he had reused legs. So yeah, so you're well articulated, you get this robe back on, probably should have taken the lightsaber hilt out of the hand before I did this, <laughs> but it worked, it worked out okay. It's fine. Everything's fine here. How are you? Um, and yeah, obviously the last thing to do with this review is do a little peg test. Using the much loved Kessel Run figure stands here. Yep, fits perfectly. Nice and snug. Three different size peg pegs on these uh, on these stands as well as that extra little pull out tab you can peg in peg in there and uh, yeah a little bit of extra a little bit of extra support for your figures so yeah she looks good and again another character sort of went too quick it served the purpose none of those Jedi were ever going to make it through the series um, but yeah she was a cool character you know she's little bit of spunk about her i liked her a lot um yeah i'd love to hear what your thoughts on this figure are please give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the review subscribe if you're new to do lots and lots of lots of stuff here on the on the on the old channel um that's about all i've got for young jackie lon padawan some more videos coming up real soon please tune in We'll see you, see you on the next one. Until then, may the force be with you always.